Hi everyone, Chris here. Uh, almost spring, getting there, and today I decided to finally replace the rear wiper blade on our Chevy Traverse. Now, I've heard horror stories from people saying they go to the dealer and they tell them they have to replace this entire wiper assembly, which costs a lot of money. But I discovered that behind this cover is just a regular little wiper blade clip, and all you do is behind where these two dots are here to the left a bit is the normal little catch that you push to slide the wiper blade. So you push your finger in here, I don't know if I can do this on the video, but you push it in here and you slide the blade to the passenger side and it comes off. So I'm going to try and do that now. Okay, so I've pushed the little tab in and so now it should be able to slide the blade, there we go, and it should eventually, there we go, release from the blade, from the holder, and this is the little tab you're looking to push. There's a little plastic tab under here, if you can see there. That little tab is what you push to release the wiper blade. So here's the, let me get this up. Okay. So there is the tab, this little tab where my thumb is. And you're pushing that from this side with your finger. So little fingers poking through, you can push it, it'll release and you slide it to the right and it'll come right off. Now the other tip is to take this and put it somewhere in the orientation you took it off so that when you get your new blade, which in this case for this car is a 12 inch wiper blade and this is an Anko one but it could be anything. And so what you do, hang on a sec, I'll get it out of the package. Here's the new blade, and because I kept the old one in the right orientation, I know I have to flip this around so that my two pieces match. There you go. It's a pretty good match for a blade. Looks a little bit longer, but it's pretty much the same. So we'll take this, and we'll try to put it on. Yeah. Okay, so I've got the new blade. It's sitting right at the entrance to the slot that it goes into. It's like a U-shaped piece of metal that that fitting goes into. So if I pull now, I should go to slide it to the left and get it to go in. It took two hands, I think, so yeah, it's going to take two hands, but you slide it over. So it did take two hands. I had to get both hands on here and push it to the left. And it did click in, so it's nice and secure now, so I can push this. Actually, let me show you. This is the nice new blade. I push this up against the window again. All good. Save a little bit of money not going to the dealership to fix that. Now, if you see this blade, this is the old one, it's completely flat. There's none of that flappy bit of rubber there. Completely gone, completely broken off by all the snow and ice this winter. So, glad I could get it fixed. Now this can go in the trash.